I'm Anil Kumar, sharing with you a very important question on combinations and Pascal's triangle. The question here is, toothpicks are laid out to form triangles as shown below. First pattern has three toothpicks, second has nine, third contains 18, and so on. How many toothpicks will be in the 10th pattern? You are given a couple of choices. You can always pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Now, this is a very popular question in many competitive exams, and that's the reason I've taken it up. Now, as you are given here, we have the numbers as 3, 9, and 18. These will be multiples of 3, correct? So, we need to find... So this is our first pattern, second pattern, third pattern. We have to find how many in tenth. Since there are multiples of 3, we can say it is 3 times 1, 3 times 3, and 3 times 6. Most of the questions we can get solution from the Pascal's triangle. So let's try to see where these numbers are when you look at Pascal's triangle. So let's look at it. So, so that's the Pascal's triangle here. And the numbers which we are looking for is 1, 3, and 6. So as you can see, 1, 3, and 6 is, you can see like this also, right? Okay, you can see from here also, but let's go like this. So 1, 3, and 6. If I write to, if I try to write their position, then we know for the first position here this number corresponds to the term number or let me write in terms of combination maybe term number let's say begin with so term number is basically the row number is 0 1 2 right and the diagonal is 0 diagonal correct this position here is is term number 3 and the diagonal is 1 and then we have this position which is t 4 2 correct so that is how the pattern is moving on so the number in the first one could be written as in general if we go move on we could write this as consider this now let's go go back to our sheet right so what we find here is it is 1 you can find in term number 2, 0 and 3 you can find in term number 3, 1 and uh, this you can find in term number 4, 2 and so on, correct? So the tenth one should be where? So this is, this is the first, second and third. So for the tenth one, we have a number which is more than 3 and then less than 3. So it should be 11, 9. Do you see that? So that T11, 9 is the number of uh, toothpicks which you can find, right? Of course, 3 times, right? So we have to multiply 3 times all these numbers. Is it okay? So that is how we can get the solution. Now, beauty of combinations with Pascal's triangle is that you can quickly calculate this number using combinations right so basically in the tenth pattern we are looking for three times c 11 9 is it okay so that is what you're looking for and that really means it is three times 11 factorial divided by 9 factorial times 11 minus 9 factorial right which is three times 11 times 10 times 9 factorial divided by 9 factorial 11 minus 9 is 2 2 factorial perfect so 9 factorial cancels and we get 11 we get here 3 times 11 times 10 divided by 2 times 1 which is 2 right you can always use calculator or just divide so it becomes 5 
55 times 3, right? So 55 times 3, which is 3 times 5, 15, 1, 165, right? So option B is the correct option for us. So there is a general formula here now, which you could always use 3 times. So let me write down the general formula for some of you, as it could help in many exams, right? Uh, C, n plus 1, n minus 1. Is it okay? So that is how you could actually find the solution of such questions. I am Anil Kumar. If you appreciate, that will be great. But feel free to post questions and subscribe to my videos. Thank you and all the best.